Good morning, guys. Another new day. We're gonna go to the dog park today. What do you think about that? I'm gonna go run around outside in the dog park. Maybe meet some new friends. What do you think? I'm not too <laughs> sure I trust the locals. <laughs> it's a good place, Diesel, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> Excited. Excited? So, so right. Always forget to do that. <clears throat> so right now, Frank is with the doctor. He's been there overnight since yesterday. He's about to get an MRI. Right? And what's that? Is that when they scan the tissues? I'm not a doctor, but what does MRI stand for? Oh, we have Google. no idea what they're doing to him right now, but it's, it's a an scan MRI. of some sort. Yeah, you know, it'll tell them what's wrong, where to go from here. Mm -hmm. So that's supposed to be happening at two o'clock, and it is now after two, right? It's two o eight, so they probably just started with him. Uh, they're gonna have to put him under, and then wait for him to wake up after. And as soon as he's awake and coherent, they're gonna give us a call, and we're gonna go over there and say hi to him and see how he's doing. He's gonna stay with the doctor until the surgery, though. But uh, we really want to go and say hi to him yet. Looking forward to that. How are you feeling? How are you handling everything? I don't know. You okay? Yeah, I'm okay. I've just never had Frankie away from me without being in the care of my mom. So, mm. a little bit anxious. Never left him at a doctor before? No. Mm. Has he ever had any health issues? Not before now. Nice. So this is Frank's first time in an unfamiliar place overnight, too? Yep. In eight years? In eight years. Wow. Unless he was with me. Okay, well, I'm sure he's doing fine. He's in the right place. Mm -hmm. They're keeping him comfy. He's in the right place for if anything goes wrong. Come here! Come here! Come on, Chevy. Come here. Get up there. Get up there. Who's my big baby? Who's my big fluff? Look at that big guy. Who's my big fluff. You worried about your little brother? No. Nope. He's actually my big brother. I'm the puppy. I'm a tiny little fluff. <laughs> so he thinks. Diesel. Diesel's anxious about mm. everything in life, so we don't really, we can't gauge how he's feeling about Frank. <laughs> well, he said we're going to go meet some other dogs. I'm very nervous. What if they're not nice? You're nervous too. I don't know what if they don't like me. <laughs> so stinky. All right, guys, let's get all suited up. Let's let's go to the dog park. We found a really good off-leash recreation area, uh, just uh, north of the university by the South Saskatchewan River. Uh, there's a parking lot it's called Sutherland Parking Lot. You locals probably know about it already. It's right beside Circle Drive, or before the bridge. Looks like a massive open area, and it's just for dogs and their owners to. Play around without leashes, so let's go. You wanna go? You wanna go for a walk? Wanna go for a walk? To the park? <laughs> to the park? Oh no! Oh, I'm so excited! His tail hurts. <laughs> Did he whip you with his tail? Yeah. Alright boys. Here we go. I got it. Can you run away? Oh Jeff, that way. Going to the park, going to the park. Gonna have fun, lots of fun. Right, Diesel? I want a Coke. Shall we come? Come on, boys. Let's go in the magic room. Can you sit? Sit. I'm scared. Sit. Shall we sit? Sit, sit boys. Sit down. Sit. Wait. It only works if you sit, okay? The door closes and it opens and we're somewhere else. Magic. Wow. You ready? Wait. Wait. Dad go first. Wait. Okay. Wait. Okay. <laughs> the door almost got it. Why are you pulling it? Let's go. There's Chevy over there making friends. Diesel's still on the leash just for a little bit because he's a little bit high strung right now and he might scare some other dogs off. Better than we 
expected though. Yeah, he's much better than we expected. He'll be going off leash soon. I just want to get some of his energy out of him first. A little bit of the anxiety needs to die down first. Yeah. Getting a little more warmed up to the situation of being around other dogs. Yeah. Hey buddy! <laughs> oh, she listens so well. <laughs> I love you. You're even bigger than my little guy. Come on, Chef. Chevy. Come on, Chef. This dog park is just huge. Wide open. It's got bush. It's got open space. It's all fenced in. All right, Diesel. You're not going to embarrass me, are you? Diesel. And he's gone. I think he should be okay. He's got most of his energy out of him now. Yeah, he's just a little anxious. He's whiny. Yeah. <laughs> he's not a mean pup. He's a lot better since we got him fixed. The anxiety's going down. <laughs> Look at this little guy. Stop following me. <laughs> Chevy. 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 Leave him alone. Chevy, come here. He wants to play, that's why. <laughs> <laughs> Chevy, is that your friend? <laughs> Diesel's off in the bush exploring. There we go. <laughs> oh, we got another buddy here. Hey, guy. Definitely a little doggy wonderland here. Nice trails, like everything is very well kept specifically just so you can come here and take your dog off the leash and it's a long walk we've been walking for a while well we also walk very slowly because the dogs are sniffing everything we need this in Steinbach times two we need two of these Diesel! there's Chevy right here yeah. went off the head. and the South Saskatchewan River is right down there Chevy. Oh, there's Diesel. There's Diesel. And some friends. Hey, guys. <laughs> Hi. You like cameras? Hi. <laughs> Gotta stay here with us, Diesel. Come on. Diesel. Chevy. Diesel. Diesel. Come on. Chevy. Diesel. This way. Come on. Come on, Here's Chevy, Diesel, stay with us. Come on, bud. <laughs> Come here. Stimulation. Here he comes. Dun 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 dun. So happy. <laughs> Wooded areas for them to go running through. Man, I love this place. It's perfect. If you live in Saskatoon and you have a dog and you didn't know about this place yet, uh, just Google recreational, uh, no, off-leash recreational park. And uh, the parking lot is called Sutherland Parking Lot for some reason, but it's not in Sutherland neighborhood. You just just Google off leash, go like Google Maps, go to off leash recreational park in Saskatoon, and it'll bring this up. That's how I found it. It's right along the river here. I can't and, imagine how amazing this place must be in the summertime. This is just the winter. Yeah. We're very lucky that we came on a week where it was so mild out weather wise. Yeah, it was like plus four today. I think it's still plus three. Yeah. That's above freezing, so you Americans, that's, uh, or for you Americans, that's mid-30s, high 30, maybe 38, somewhere in there. 38, maybe close to 40. Can't you need really. need to Google it. <laughs> yeah. I know 32 is the freezing point in Fahrenheit, but oh, okay. we're just above freezing, a few degrees above freezing, but this is a really nice weather for January in Saskatoon. We're used to minus 30, minus 40, or below. I am such a proud mom right now. Hazel, you are great. You're amazing. Yeah. Oh, someone pooped right on the trail. No. Oh no, that's not a poop. That's okay. Like a piece of paper or something. And the park here in the corners, I've seen one of them at least. They have garbage cans and they also supply uh, doggy poop bags. We I have only seen. Own, yeah, we brought our own, but I would say you should bring your own too. Make sure you clean up after the dogs. But there is at least one, one station where they offer that in the back corner. Diesel. We're coming up to another one of those stations I was just talking about. Look at this, the cyclists slow to walking pace, yield to walkers and dogs. Even cyclists have to yield to dogs here. And usually cyclists are given all the authority to do whatever they want. 
Nope, dogs have the right of way here. <laughs> oh, no, you guys don't want to see that, but look. Dog waste bags, they give them for you here. Or they supply them. Pretty cool. Look at that, you can go all the way down there. Isn't that beautiful? Or you can go down there. Is this fun, Chev? This is a doggy heaven. And it also gets us out and moving. We go for a walk too. That's good. It's got to be at least a mile all the way around this park. It's big. So it's called Sutherland Beach Dog Park, and that's the map. We are down here right now. We parked over there. We walked all the way around the outside of it yet, and then there's these trails leading through the middle of it. Super cool. If you guys live around here, I seriously suggest, if you have dogs, bring them here. This is awesome. Oh, I found the Mexican short hairs entrance. Just came out we actually got to meet with the actual surgeon who's going to be doing the surgery on Frank and some good news is that they're gonna be doing the surgery early tomorrow morning 9 a.m. so uh, we just got to go say hi to Frank really quickly and see him one last time before the surgery he was all hooked up to uh, the IVs and everything to get his body all prepped and ready for tomorrow morning should take a few hours and uh, you know by early afternoon we should hear back from the surgeon uh, that they're finished hopefully with some good news and he'll they be in confident. here they were very confident that it was uh, that they can fix it or at least greatly improve his comfort I learned a lot about spines and medical things because he explained everything to us in layman's terms so that we could understand what they're doing and uh, it, it I, I feel I feel smarter after all that. <laughs> but I, like I was back in college. So to take our mind off things, we're gonna go down to the pool really quick, and we're gonna hope that these boys are well behaved. Don't bark at anybody. You stay quiet. Him, I don't think would bark. It's, he sniffs at the door bottom, and that's all he does. Yeah, it's just Diesel. He uh. He's got a reflex. As soon as he hears something, he barks before he checks it out. It's not like an annoying, constant bark, but he usually lets out one bark. I don't want him to even let out one. We're gonna ask the front desk to 
let us know if our boys make any noise. Yeah, we won't be long. We're just going one floor down to the pool and hot tub just to take our minds off stuff. And it's only open for an hour or so, so I think it'll be fine. Mm -hmm. You're gonna be good? You're gonna be good for mom and dad? Playing all sweet and innocent with mom. Yeah, of course you are. <laughs> Here we go, look at this. Oh, and you're going to the hot tub. Is there a way to turn it on somewhere? Probably over there. No, it's right here, probably. Uh, 10 minutes, 20, 15 minutes, 30 minutes? 10 minutes. 10 minutes? Okay. Is it ready? Ready. There's the jet. Oh, ho, ho. oh that's so that nice. looks nice. I'm going to jump in right away. But I want to see how deep this is. So it's 0.8 meter. Not even one meter here in the shallow end. 1.1 1. 1 meters here, so there is no deep end. Oh yeah, this is <laughs> no diving. But just in case, you know, if you're uh, tired of the sun, they got that there for you to keep you in the shade. Just in case the roof wasn't enough for you. Got one over there too, for your convenience. So we let the front desk know uh, what room we're in and that our dogs were there and if there was absolutely any noise coming from there, come get us right away. And uh, it sounded like we don't have any neighbors around us anyway. In the room that we're in, there's no one beneath us either. So she said it's pretty good. It's pretty good. And plus those walls are pretty, they're, they're, they're thick cement. They're supposed to be soundproof, but I'm gonna go and join her. All right, Diesel. Your mother and brother are out here already. I think I've got the key to get back in the room. Where did I put it? I put it in this pocket. There it is. Okay. Don't pull too hard. Good boy. Come on. Come on. Let's go in the magic room. Chevy, you ready for the magic room? Um, this magic room scares me. I don't know how it works. Here we go. Did you hear that? Did you hear it? Come on, Diesel. Come on. No, 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 no. You gotta stay in the magic room. That's how it works. First, the door's gotta close. Smells like cigarettes in here. Someone was smoking in here. No, not smoking. Just freshly out from the smoke. If they were smoking in here, they'd be much stronger. Reeks, anyway. See, the way it works, first you gotta let the door close, wait a few seconds, and then it opens, then you're in a new place. That's how it works. Oh, we didn't press what floor we want. Oh. We're still... That's why we're not moving. <laughs> we just got out of the hot tub, okay? We're relaxed. We're a little dopey, but... He says, why is it taking forever? Where's this new place? In China? Here we go. Whoa. Come on guys, let's go out this way. <laughs> Not on the building, Diesel. Not on the building. Go a little further out here. Oh, they got a big truck park back here today. Oh, they still got their Christmas lights on over there. That's nice. The weather has been so nice out. It's still pretty warm out here. Yep. I doubt it's even freezing. even freezing and it's soaking wet. I know, right? And this is January. Usually in January, it's minus 30. We were talking about this before, right? It's still got to be around zero or around the freezing point. Thirsty after that long walk? All those five minutes? Not even. <laughs> Successful walk, though. They were pretty well behaved. Yeah. Very well behaved. Are. They always are. After today, I trust them a lot more now after the dog park. Yeah. It was great. Hey, don't sniff that garbage, please. No, we gotta empty it. We will. Okay, I'm sorry. I just thought there was something in there for me, but I was wrong. Oh, on that one too. That's fine. I'm sorry. I like this one better. I got a scratchy ear. Got his tongue poking out. But anyways, guys, I'm gonna end the vlog here. I'm gonna get some videos edited for you and. Uh, Edit one of mine. Edit one of Britt's videos too. Again, I'm going to advertise for her channel. It's down below in the description of every single one of my videos. There's a link to Britt's Beat. 
It's her channel. She's going to be posting more stuff on there real soon. Let's go subscribe over there. Please. <laughs> Good night. Good night, guys. We'll see you tomorrow. And, of course, don't forget to subscribe to my channel here, too. This is my channel. Please. My videos. So, subscribe. <laughs> Please. See you tomorrow. Tomorrow we, uh, tomorrow's the surgery for Frank. So, we'll let you know how it went then. See you then.